Part of assessing a dog clinically is being able to take a pulse rate. It's really important to be able to tell if there is a serious emergency and to have something other than gum colour to report to your vet. Use the um, femoral pulse located high up in the inner left or right thigh where the femoral artery runs. Start in the middle and move two fingers around until you find it. Do not use your thumbs to locate it. Take the pulse at rest. So the ultimate area or the best area to find a pulse is the femoral pulse um, in the inside of either the left or the right back leg. But what you can also do is just take your hand, any fingers other than your thumb, and just place it on the side of your dog where you imagine the heart to be. And through the chest there, I can feel Alan's heart beating. It's a pretty crude way of counting the pulse. It's not as as accurate probably and then you actually feeling the pulse itself but it's decent enough and it will give you a good idea so when we go for the femoral pulse which is the ideal one as I say it's going to be the inner left or right bat leg so if I show Alan by picking him up where I want you to pop your hands good boy so high up in the inner thigh almost where the leg joins the body and we're going to use these two fingers avoid using your thumb I start high up midway and right on it there I can feel that nice and strong. And I count for what I can feel for 15 seconds and then I multiply by four. Good boy. Now reasons why we might see an increased pulse rate are things like pain, fear, we see it in heat stroke. Some toxins like chocolate can increase the pulse rate. So can things like dehydration and shock. And a decreased pulse rate we may see in situations such as a heart problem, something like um, hypothermia, so when they're very cold, and also with toxins such as narcotics. But what is normal? First up, the larger the dog, the slower the pulse rate. Dogs under six months of age or puppies will have a faster rate than they do once they are more mature. 120 to 160 beats per minute for a puppy is within normal range, with our larger breed puppies sitting at the lower end. Rates over 220 beats per minute in puppies over two or three weeks of age are classed as tachycardia, which is an abnormally fast heart and requires immediate attention. As your puppy matures and reaches over four to five months, it goes through sort of puberty time, their rate will slow to their adult rate, which is between 60 to 100 beats per minute, up to 120 beats per minute for our toy breeds or our tiny breeds. Get used to taking your dog's pulse. Make a note of what normal is for them so that you know when it is faster or perhaps slower than normal.